Welcome. Hey, hey, wow. hey. Look who it is. Wait, who's that guy? Look who's that guy. <laughs> That's Nathan. Oh. Everybody, please meet Nolan North. Uh, Hi, you Nolan. may know him from certain shows, in particular a video game. What's the name of that video game again, Drew? Uh, Arkham City? Arkham yeah. Knights? Yeah. I don't remember. I do that. It's hard to remember. You do so many, sir. There's you so just many. Do so many. I just yeah, try to destiny. keep myself busy. But thank you for joining us today. So why don't you give us your name and introduce yourself to everybody here? Uh, my name is Nolan. Uh, I'm a Scorpio. I'm more of a dog person than a cat person, but I'm open to long-haired cats. And I'm here to talk about Uncharted, the Boom. movie. Oh, oh, this is this dude. is exciting, guys. I'm dude. telling you, this is this has been that was my. Is that your lucky piece. dice? I thought you were roll, trying to roll a 20 to see. None of these ever been in my ears. I'm going to look like a spy. Back in the trailer, I look like a spy. Yeah. Stop uh, in the ear. No. Uh, this is exciting. Uh, this is a big banner day because uh, since we started, I think, Uncharted 2, there's been talks of a movie. Yeah. Every year there was talks of a movie. And then I think it's gone through seven or eight directors um uh, it, it's just been ridiculous um back in the day they were talking hugh jackman as nathan drake and they they, they bounced all over the map uh, you know and i think they've hit on something really really exciting with this one uh because they and we'll get into this before but they 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 avoided the big uh potholes or pitfalls or whatever you want to call it that a lot of um, studios do when they try to adapt a, a popular video game franchise to a film and we'll get into that but um, yeah. I don't know uh, first of all I think we should get into it but I want to know I want to gauge the level of excitement from the team here <clears throat> yeah uh, what do you, that Pagan clearly is excited because <laughs> she, she came prepared she came she came Good. prepared to like um I mean, I don't know to climb things. And yeah, you know how people. it is. I gotta do trailer talk at like eight I, o'clock. I gotta go hunt for Henry Avery's uh, grave at nine. I, no, I didn't know, know I needed this, but I kind of, I kind of want a female Nathan Drake now. <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's, that kind of works. So I, I'm, I'm kind of into have, it. Oh, crap. There we have, go. Have you played Tomb Raider? <laughs> yeah, that's true. Well played. I have played Tomb Raider. Well played, one. They well called played, me sir. Dude Raider. I love it. <laughs> Dude, Dude Raider. I support yeah, this because it's you. I don't know if I'd um, want to watch this like if it just generally popped up. I mean, the other thing, too, is is that it's the only in my memory is the only like the, the cinematic cutaways on on the game was insane. Like Marisa would come up and go, oh, my God, are you watching a movie mm -hmm. like yeah. they got to it's they can't just slap together a game movie here and, and think that everybody's going to love it because yeah. these people, the bar is set. Like, I mean, yeah. this thing better rock. Oh, yeah. yeah. I think, sure. uh, I, I, you know, I'm, I'm personally, I'm super excited. I've been excited for a long time for an Uncharted movie ever since I played the games. While I'm playing the games, I, all I could think about is like, this would be epic as in live action. Like every, every, you say every. That about everything. You are the no, pop yeah. culture, wet your pants about <laughs> everything. We're going to cross Pokemon with a unicorn. Yes, yes I'm in. Yes, I'm in. The Pokecorn is here. Yeah, like, by the way, by the way. Pokemon is a completely different movie. <laughs> yeah. It's Pokemon. Oh, it's Pokemon. I wanted to know, I wanted to know if, you, if you caught that one. Yeah. Pokemon uh, is no, no, no one's Pokemon is uh, yeah. that's on Pornhub. That's yeah, on Pokemon's fans, where you go to the theater and the, everything. Why are my feet sticking to the floor? Oh, <laughs> oh, no. It's butter. That's why. That's why no one's not allowed to wear shoes in my house. That's, it's Coca Cola. Duh. Stephanie, what are your thoughts? Or how are you feeling about this? Oh, I'm excited. I, I've 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 watched it through a few times, maybe, um, you know, frame by frame. So I oh, done your research. Yeah, I did. I like this. Nice. I came prepared. I did my homework. You just like Tom Holland. <laughs> yeah. We had to keep that secret, though. We knew you were at the set way back in the retro replay days, mm -hmm. and we had to keep a secret of you that going was a hard there and to keep. Remember that? Well, no, was... I mean, if, I think people knew I went there. I just, it was just, you know, I, I would kept hoping like, hey, you know, maybe if you just need it. But it was just, it was a photo op. It was a publicity thing. So people can get there and I got to meet him. And he's, he wanted to talk to me about the character a little bit. But it was just like, if any advice? And I'm like, no, just do your version. And 
I'm just happy to be here. I just wasn't with COVID because, you know, I went all the way to Barcelona and I was like, can't go anywhere. You know, <laughs> 48 <laughs> hours. They're like, you can't leave, leave your room because of COVID. Uh, yeah. what? I think I think it was more than a photo. I mean, based on the trailer, I think he's he did a little studying on you, buddy. Like, I think he's playing a little into the mm -hmm. Nolan North. I think, he, I think he did. I think he did some research. So, uh, yeah, well, he, a... I mean, he did. We had yeah. some good. We had some really good conversations about yeah. it. And, uh, <clears throat> uh, but let's take a look at it. Let's just yeah, see let's, and let's I'm... jump in. I mean, people yeah. are like, yeah. "Yeah, stop talking. Let's see it." Okay, <laughs> Shut up and let's play this thing. <laughs> all right, Jeez. count us down. Alrighty, okay, I'll count down. Uh, I'm pressing play in three, two, one, play. <laughs> There are places out there you can't find on any map. They're not gone. Sorry. They're just lost. Ooh. Hey, kid. A little young for a bartender, aren't you? A little old for prom, aren't you? Why the map? Bar this movie. path that Ferdinand Magellan took to sail around the oh, world. You know your history. Biggest treasure that's never been found. Five billion, easy. I think you're here because of your brother. Well, you know my brother, Sam. Treasure! Treasure! You find that gold, you find him too. Okay. Who the hell is this? I'm a friend of Sully's. Sully doesn't have any friends. I should not have That's Chloe. You are a collector. Well, I dabble. I'm dabble. Oh. My family has been looking Dude, for this fortune awesome. for a very long time. So much blood. Well, I'm pretty sure he's just threatening to kill me. So Don't touch your ear like that. You look like he's a gibbon. Love this. You have no idea who you partnered with. <laughs> I've been dreaming about this stuff since I was a kid. Oh, my brother Sam yeah, left one final box. clue. Yeah. <laughs> Here's my favorite part. Boys, we ain't just about to get a proper Scottish welcome. What? Oh crap! He said it. He said the thing. Exclusively in movie theaters, dude. Oh. Wow. February. I mean, I could go off. I right. I have so many thoughts. Uh, I don't. I don't even know where to begin. Uh, I, I, mean, I, I actually I do. Okay, go. Possibly dude, my go. favorite thing is Zeppelin. Yeah, Did Zeppelin oh, ramble great on. Choice. I'm sorry, but that's like a great choice. Mm -hmm. It's just like it's, you know, it's so classic. Uh, I want to hear your thoughts first. I, I don't want to go first. I have. I have. I. I, I will say this. If anybody think wants me to, uh, you know, I, I really like it. I think they. I. I'm excited for it. Yeah, I am. Uh, yeah. I, I'm. I, I'll jump on it real quick. Mm -hmm. This that trailer is bringing some serious energy, and I love it. Like the like you're right. The vibe that, that ramble on. Like as soon as that song mm -hmm. kicks in, I'm like, all right. Uh, <laughs> and this looks, guys. This looks polished. Like it's mm -hmm. the best looking video game movie I have ever seen. Like mm -hmm. it just like, it, it, like. It just looks so good, like, and I don't even mean like plot wise because I have no idea like how it's gonna. But like, like the cinematography here looks good. It looks crisp. It doesn't look cheap. It looks like they spent some serious money here. This is the real deal. Oh, they like, did. This is this is a movie movie. <laughs> like this isn't yeah, like oh did. we made a video game movie. Like this is like we are making a movie movie here. Like this is legit. Um, I love the name drops. This has got some serious fan service, and I'm I'm in. Uh, and again, like it, it's literally what I wanted when I first played the game. It's taking those epic set pieces and bringing them to life in a way that I, I've never seen before. Um, I, I'm, I'm totally in it. I will say, and as a fan, I could say this, I'm excited and 
uh, as a non-fan, I could say my wife, she's not, she's never played any of the games. She watched the trailer and she's like, holy shit, that looks like a lot of fun. We're going to see that. And I was like, yeah, we're going to see that. Uh, so <laughs> mm-hmm. we're, we're in. I mean, it looks, it looks so good. I got two problems. Oh. All right. Good, All good. Right. I like that. Let's go. One, I'm not a fan of Mark Wahlberg anywhere. So it's hard for me because oh. I know Sully and they're just like him as Sully is just, I, I get over it, get over it, get over it, get over it. So that's a personal problem. Mm-hmm. Um, and then, but as a trailer, does it do a good job of getting me excited to watch it? I mean, yes, there's a lot of action stuff, but am I going to go watch it simply because of what it is? You know what I mean? Like you could see the different shots that were pulled from the game. I want to go see and do the comparison. But as a trailer, did it do a good job of making me want to watch the movie? I don't know. I don't know if really? it did oh, as a good story in, 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 as a trailer. Now, am I going to watch yeah. it? Of course. Does it look great? Fucking yeah. His voice all the, also bugs me a little bit because I hear Nolan's no- voice in my head. So there's I'll a, say there's that. A pro- you're gonna, you're I gonna, have a, you're mad at me. I have a problem. <laughs> I have a problem. I could, on, I could uh, dub him if it would help you. I could dub I, while I have a problem on a personal level on those things. And I'll just, I'll, you, can, you can go to the movie with headphones in and I'll be in the microphone going. Yeah, there they go. should do. Yeah. That would <laughs> be you amazing. Version, I guess. You or should you do that. Like, yeah. That should be a like cameo for service? me. Take me in and I'll say the lines. On the DVD commentary, there's an audio Aren't you a little to be a bartender? Aren't you a little too old to go to prom? Yeah, there you see, go. I, I like it already oh, better. I love it. I'm yeah. sorry. Although that was a good line. Uh, yeah, I don't know. So I have, I, you know, I agree with everything you said. The, the music does do a lot of lifting for it. Um, I love the scene on that when you know, on the craziness of the airplane. I mean, it takes it to a whole other level that even can escape mm-hmm. that. Mm-hmm. But as this, I don't think the trailer does a good job to to make me come to watch it if I'm somebody that doesn't know anything about it or. Is it my own personal opinion of not liking that as Sully and not and hearing Nolan's noise, no, Nolan's voice in the head when I hear Nathan Drake? So it didn't make me go, oh my god. But then I went, oh my god, about Green Knight and as a piece of crap. If this so. was like an like an untitled Tom Holland Mark Wahlberg action flick without any of the characters attached from Uncharted, would you feel differently? Well, that's the problem. I don't know if I if I could separate the two. If I just saw that all by itself, I'd be like, yeah, I guess so. But, you know, of course I want to see it. It's uncharted. I want to do all the comparison. I want to see how it goes down. And, and so do you make a trailer for the fans or do you make a trailer for the non-fans? And I think in a game this size, you got to make a trailer for the fans. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Mm-hmm. And, and I think... That's this, a very good I mean, point. Let's just go down the checklist of like what makes Uncharted Uncharted, right? I mean, is there a witty spider monkey like Nathan Drake? Yeah, I mean, mm-hmm. he Tom Holland's clearly got the the athletic spider speed. monkey. Yeah, or Gibbon. <laughs> I mean, you know, he's he's doing some he's doing some chandelier sh- chandelier uh, stuff, yeah, and he's, cool. he's uh, mm-hmm. and yeah. is there great chemistry between Drake and Sully? I think we're seeing that. There's some great, mm-hmm. just wit- mm-hmm. witty one liners. Is there big action set pieces? Yeah, I mean, yes. we're seeing that. I mean, we see the plane <laughs> sequence. We see like the you know the 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 treasure hunt or the the boat sequence with the pirate ships. Mm-hmm. Is there treasure? Check. Yes. Like, uh, is there a sassy as hell Chloe? Yes. Uh, yeah. Is there ancient tombs and puzzles and booby traps? Yeah. We, we, the trailer gives us all the. Is there. Does, is, does Drake kill hundreds of bad guys? Well, that's the one thing we have to see. But <laughs> I, I think this checks a lot of the, like, is this an Uncharted movie? Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. right away, it's checking all those boxes. And, that, and that's what this trailer did. It, it just went down the line and be like, we're making Uncharted, guys. Full stop. We're not making anything else. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, yes. And then, then, so they made it for the fans then. And, and if that's the case, they did. They checked all the boxes. Yeah. It's everything you want. And uh, let's, let's. Well, let's, I mean, I would like, a, a part of me disagrees with that, uh, PJ, that, that, that it checks all the boxes and it's what they want because there's been a lot of fan outcry against like the casting and um, putting elements of four in a prequel style, you know, film about um, the origins of Nathan Drake and stuff. And I, I see all of that outcry and I see that and I, I understand it because like obviously I'm a fan um, but I I think this is a standalone like this is not canon this is just Sony it's trying not canon. to bring where is this in the timeline well, this well is no here's the deal be... let, 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 let me speak to that for a second yeah. because it, mm-hmm. it, it's very interesting it is this this is unequivocally not a prequel it precedes oh, okay. Apologies. the the uncharted stories but as in any artistic thing you've got to give 
uh, the filmmakers an opportunity to create their own thing aside from the stories. They're, they're, uh, what, you know, a lot of people were uh, talked about, hey, oh, they did, they, they stole the, the, the thing from the, uh, you know, the, him falling out of a plane. Yeah. From well, three, I don't yeah. think they, that's not stealing. That is an homage mm -hmm. to mm -hmm. one of the greatest sequences in the game. I, and I think that could be a great thing if this is successful and they do more, do an homage to the train scene in two. I mean, th th I thought that was a yeah. great little, t and yeah. they, there's a twist, you know, I mean, a car Who knocks said they stole that? Who, some, how would oh, you just, steal just from a, your I own? I saw it on fan comments. Yeah, people are. Fan comments said, oh, you know, they, they took it directly. But I think what they did, so so they, they um, you know, allude to canon. Um, but uh, put it this way, this, this is unequivocally, it's Nathan Drake in his 20s. Mm -hmm. And so the, the greatest thing about this concept is, they're not trying to do a one for one remake and certainly not, you know, like we're going to do the movie mm -hmm. version of Uncharted two or three or four. Yeah. No. Um, it, Drake never went for Magellan's treasure. So they picked a new kind of thing. Yeah. It has some uh, uh, ships and, and, you know, are they pirate ships or is it Magellan ships? You know, it's like, I'm yeah. sure they, they mm -hmm. allude, you know, they refer to those things. But they were able to to take a time period that none of us as gamers know Nathan Drake as. And I've said this before to so many people. When you put 5, 10, 20, 100, 200 hours into a game, you're Nathan Drake. You're playing this game as Nathan Drake. If you're if you, they did that one-to-one -one kind of thing, it, it you'd have to sit more. passively for two hours in the theater. And you're like, I wouldn't have done that. Yeah. I wouldn't yeah. have, mm -hmm. then it, and then you're really comparing it to the game. They brought in Chloe. That's great. I'm sure I, I have this is I know this is not a spoiler. Nobody has to go run and get mad at me. I'm sure they will have to introduce Elena sometime in if it's not in this movie sometime mm -hmm. in this part of the franchise, mm -hmm. yeah. even yeah. though in the games we meet her in the first he meets her in the first game. Yeah. Right. But mm -hmm. she's too big of a character to ignore. Yeah. For the movie. So totally. I, I love the idea that they uh, they went in the twenties. I love. I think Tom is great, especially after getting to meet him. He's a fan of the game. He's tremendously talented, not only as an actor but as as an athlete. I mean, the guy. He, I, yeah. I, from what I remember, somebody telling me, uh, jumping from those boxes, he did that. They actually had boxes suspended. I know he, he may have had a wire, but he's doing that. I mean, that's yeah. remarkable. Oh, that is yeah. not VFX. That's not that's... not a stunt guy. It's him. Yeah, that's um, cool. It, yeah. And and they they had amazing stunt people on this as well I know but, um, and I think they they got it I mean they got it I think Ruben Fleischer is a, an amazing director and he's perfect for this because as he told me himself his comedy his background is is in in comedy, and he found the right balance at least in the trailer so far mm -hmm. of my, my favorite part of course anybody who knows me knows it's just that the Scotsman. Just what? I mean, he. he that's. I mean, mm -hmm. <laughs> this is the yes. comparison I make watching it. I would have said it the same way. What? I thought the same Just, thing. And then, the, yeah. then the, the, yeah. the other part is watch his face when the guy grabs him. If you go back and watch the trailer, he goes, "What?" Yeah. And then it's mm -hmm. like it, it, it's genuine. I love the fact that no, you don't see Drake taking out a bunch of people. That iconic spin when he puts the the thing on and makes mm -hmm. that. That's yeah. that's yeah. Nathan Drake that's gameplay. Unreal. That's totally. awesome. Totally. But that look he gives on that plane when the guy grabs him and then throws him viciously, <laughs> yeah. that's the Nathan Drake I know. The one who was the everyman. The one who didn't get up right away and like, let's go. I mean, he, it, things hurt. Yeah. And I think that's what made him uh, somebody that everyone can kind of, um, you know, kind of uh, uh, you, be along with that adventure yeah, and like, feel yeah, like that yeah. guy's You've just like a, me. Yeah. You've been on a lot of sets. What was that set like? <clears throat> Oh, it was great. I mean, wise. you know, it's was, it was amazing. It's this huge scale set where it was, it was outside of a location that I was watching them film this scene. I was like, this is unbelievable. Um, but it was just, it was just, everyone was there. Um, I didn't get to meet him, but Chuck Roven was there. I mean, he's doing his mm -hmm. thing. And, uh, you know, the writers came up to me, wanted to meet me, said, hey, I hope we did all right. And everybody tells me, like, I just hope we, you know, get it right for you. And I'm like, oh. thanks. You don't have to get it right for me. I mean, it's lovely. but you know, it's, and uh, great craft services. 
Big, big budget <laughs> That's things important. have That's great important. food. Absolutely important. They have yeah. great yeah. food. Gets all the best movies, all of them. Yeah, no, they yeah. get every they get single great one food. of them. Um, but no, I can't say enough about uh, you know the, the uh, all the all the what everybody involved uh, was. Uh, I mean, maybe like I talked have... a lot with uh, one of the producers, Alex Gardner, uh, uh, became a buddy of mine, and he's just loved the franchise, loved the story ever from the get go, and. Uh, again, Ruben Fleischer, I can't say enough about because he, He's you could smart. see him interacting the way that Amy yeah. and Gordon Hunt and I and Emily with the cast and the other people shooting the scenes that day. And they're just talking it out. And then they would laugh and they're like, well, 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 yeah, let's go back. Let's try that. <laughs> and you saw them and I was like, wow, this is just like what we did. They were allowed to some creative freedom. Um, and it was just, and, and you could see that it was a playful set yeah. you know um and to speak about Wahlberg, who at the, originally i had thought i was like mark when i saw them together mm -hmm. and, and i'm actually a fan of mark Wahlberg, so i and you know uh richard mcgonagall is from boston like mark Wahlberg, mm -hmm. and you know when you first thought about it and but when you see them and you see them together Oh yeah, yeah. They that they chemistry work well that, together. That, they did. They did oh, and have that's good and that's the most important yeah. thing. And now, I mean, I agree, I'm. Yeah. I, I and here's the here's my big reveal to everyone about the. I love, I love Sully in this. I I really loved. I thought I felt the opposite about Wahlberg because I I'm a fan of his. But like I was like, wow. And you know, we all saw the the you know people were like, where's the mustache? We all saw the post where he had that. Mm -hmm. And I heard in the makeup trailer, he was having a lot of fun with the porn stash. Uh, <laughs> but it was funny because I really liked him in this because he, they their dynamic together absolutely worked. And he looked and he, yeah, that's Sully. I mean, Sully in the games could handle himself, but you can see where it comes from because mm -hmm. Wahlberg yeah. is just incredible. He's a beast with his. Uh, um, He's got his quite fitness. a workout routine, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Shout yeah, out to his boy. Yeah. Yeah. What's yeah, that? Shout out to his muni his municipal brand of clo uh, uh, workout gear. Oh yeah, no, oh, I, just, nice. I like that cool. stuff. <laughs> Actually, I'm just trying I mean, to get free stuff. Well, <laughs> it might work. I know you were. You might have some insight. I mean, w w the biggest set piece we get to see here is the the plane sequence, which obviously is you know uh, right out of Uncharted Three, which looks uh, looks awesome. I mean, mm -hmm. this that can't be yeah. like the only big set piece. I mean, do you have any thoughts or insights on? Like what? 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 What more is there? Is that what? Did they blow their load in the trailer, or do you think you think they got more? More? <laughs> they did more not. Sh yeah. All right. Maybe that's another Ooh. thing. I can't. I'm not saying a word. I'm on the. I'm in their good graces on, right Nolan. now. No, yeah. I still haven't got my invite to the the world premieres, and I'm I'm I'm, I'm trying either. to get L. A. London and New York. I mean, <laughs> okay. only because my wife wants to go there. So Sony, and, if you're watching, uh, I'll be in your luggage. Just, uh, just a, a lay flat seat. <laughs> I would like, but yeah. uh, my wife will Jill take again coach. and not me. Yeah, he's going to carry on. We have to talk, buddy. I'm, 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 yeah. No, but but my it's nose uh, getting a little out of yeah, that, that, That's my that's my my thing. Yeah, I may hell if they don't invite me, I'll crash it. But the point is, like, I I can tell you this. Uh, I've seen plenty of movies where uh, you go, oh, the trailer is better than the movie. They, they that. I can say for a fact without saying any specifics, they did not blow the wad on this trailer. They, it, there's so much more, and. Um, Maybe that's why I'm also excited. I, I just, I'm also excited to be a fan of this, because uh, what we, what Amy and Naughty Dog used to provide me with, because I, as everyone knows, I'm shitty at games. Uh, they used to get a, they used to have somebody run through the game fast and then get to the cutscenes and put it on DVD, so I could just, just watch it. And you know, I remember my parents watched it. My dad was like, "Wait, wait, is this a movie? What is this game? What do you play?" I'm like, I "Have explained how that all works," but. I, I only got to see that. I I can't wait to be able just to be a fan, and yeah. to sit in the theater. And this is a this is one. And I love that at the end you heard that in theaters exclusively. Mm -hmm. That's awesome because this is a theater movie. This is grab your popcorn, yeah. settle in. Uh, I think it'll be a movie that people want to see a couple times. I, I I really and it's the dynamic that Ruben Fleischer created on that set. Um, you know Wahlberg's a pro, but he's you know he's he's fun. Uh, Tom Holland is just I, the biggest thing I can tell you that that he nailed is is the enthusiasm for the part. He is he's a he's a fan of the games. He loves the character, and I mean this guy's working all the time. He's probably bouncing off to the next film as soon as that one was done. Yeah, but he did. He was Actually, into it. I mean, yeah, I mean he <laughs> was 
I mean, he yeah, was. He filmed, yeah, I yeah, mean, he, he was, left. He left Uncharted set, and like two days later, he was on the set for, for Spider-Man, Spider-Man: Far From Home. That's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, but he's but a I mean, dude, guys, guys. But but the other thing is his physicality. I mean, his he, and he's just charming as hell. The other thing I can tell you about him is you could see him go over, he, and they had some extras in the scene. There were some little kids, and they had a ball, and he and started kicking the ball, running around. He was talking to everybody. <laughs> it's not like I'll be in my trailer. I mean, he's just outgoing, and mm, that's so cool. he, he's he's. Oh, gosh, I singing is. I mean, it's embarrassing, but I mean, he's he is the everyman. He's a he's a he's a bona fide movie star. But yeah. he's a great actor. He's very talented, and he's mm-hmm. very giving. He's one of the most mature people for his age I've ever met. And just the way he he's Nathan Drake off screen is what I'm trying to say. He talks to everybody. He's friendly to everybody. He stops for pictures. He waves to people. There's none of that bullshit about him and there's no bullshit about nathan drake and that's why i think he nailed it and i think i think Wahlberg brings a certain ferocity you know like sully looked dangerous that's why i liked about this and sully probably was pretty dangerous in his what would he be in his third eye Wahlberg's Wahlberg's just Wahlberg's. Oh, i think he's, I think he's about 40s. my age and and he looks like he's 30 Mm-hmm. So yeah. I know he does look. You know, he's, like, he's he's drinking the uh, unicorn he blood really to stay uh, stay yeah. young. Man. He's doing he's something. Well, yeah, he's also no just moving. From. He's moving weights and he's eating right. And he's just, yeah, the guy's a beast. And and let's great. let's let's look at the other guys. Banderas. Oh, oh my What God. a great villain! Yeah. You know what? Yeah. A, what a great, great. I mean, you know. I just, um, yeah. And and I, I the only thing else and the other thing that I know is with this kind of film, they only showed you a few of the characters. I'm wondering who I I. They offered me to read the script. I didn't. I didn't. I said, you know what? I want to enjoy this um, from day one. I they t- we talked about set pieces and some of the things they were doing, but I did not want to know the story because I want to watch. I told them. I said, I, I and the writers said we can get send you the script. I'm like, I really don't want a the responsibility for it leaking and I get just yeah, my head I, handed to me. And I B, stole, I, I want to enjoy this in a theater. Leaked it. Mm-hmm. I want to enjoy this myself. You know, for the first time, I want to see it. And um, Agreed. Yeah, I, I'm, 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 I think they did a really good job. And, and I will be honest with everyone that back in the day, yeah, you know, the first on I'm like, hey, I'm an on camera, I can do this. And then as the years went by, it's like, no. And now when you see the concept, I certainly can't play in my 20s. And it's like, what a great way to, to, to break the, the track record that video game adaptations get have, but by yeah. doing their own thing. And I just, I just think, um, I think it's gonna I, I knock on wood i really do hope it it does well because I, i'd like to see more adventures with these guys i think the thing that this trailer did for me more than anything is just get me psyched up about whether you're a fan or not i think they did a great job for the fans i'd love i can't wait to hear the comments from from uh you know everyone here but um I'm, I'm I'm taking up all the time, but I, I I'm 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 pumped. I there was put it this way: there was nothing in the trailer that made me go. Eh. He even got you know the oh crap. He just did. The oh, car, you know, just that. it was yeah. like one of those, and I was like, yeah. And it was great. like that great like deflated like oh crap, you know, like because he just knows he's just. <laughs> yeah. it, it, it's not. I can't get away. I, I, yeah, for all yeah. his physical ability, I'm, yeah, the car's hitting me. Yeah. yeah exactly yeah, yeah. like uh it's yeah. like it's like it's great because like when you play the games it's like there's just moments where nathan drake can't catch a break and i love that and i hope this mm-hmm. you know what i'm saying but he always finds a way to make the best of it and i yeah. think this trailer does a good job of kind of showing a little bit of that you know um mm-hmm. he's sort of just tenacious enough to get through it you know um because yeah. there's a there's a a shot too in the cargo plane where it looks like he's about to get shot like uh, there's a henchman and mm-hmm. like one of the mm-hmm. crates like takes a henchman out and he's like <laughs> and he kind of has that smirk on his face it's like all right you, you know like he's like i'll yeah. take that mm-hmm. yeah you know uh yeah i, I think that's great uh, mm-hmm. yeah a little, a little the behind the scenes mm-hmm. did you see the behind the scenes clip that playstation had no. yeah yes that was really good that made me actually want to see the movie even more than the trailer did oh, the yeah. chemistry that you talk about is really good between the two of them mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. Have you seen that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I did. You mean where they were they, the two of them talking? The two yeah. of them yeah. standing there and then they showed the clips from the movie. There's a couple other clips in there besides the what you see in the trailer. But it really mm-hmm. plays up the chemistry between the two of them. Yeah, that's Steph, good. I mean what are, what are your thoughts? You've been you've been quiet. I mean, uh, although I... Nolan hasn't shut up, so that's that's really his fault. <laughs> no, I mean I've been Mute. thinking back to the trailer Mute. too, but like I'm excited. I think it's I think it's kind of cool to see these create characters that um everyone's grown to love but to see them kind of become 
those characters. Like, you kind of see Nate evolve, I feel like, through the trailer. Like, and when he, like, straight up to, like, the holster and then shooting, like, all that build-up to that is, I think, really cool. Mm. And then for Solly, I mean, like, I have a feeling, like, maybe somehow, like, they separate or something like that at some point to, like, they're gonna meet up with Solly again sometime, and then he's gonna have, like, that mustache and the sure and he's gonna be like i actually really like this disguise or whatever it is like (laughs) this new look like Mm -hmm. i think it's Mm -hmm. there's going to be those moments um but i kind of like the factor that he's kind of like a little shaved at first like cleaned up and like i'm i'm curious because i'm excited like you know when nate's behind the bar and he's making drinks like do they know each other at that point already like there's so many questions that i have um i also Mm -hmm. saw spider webs at one point um so I'm not looking forward to the possibility of spiders, but <laughs> they're not real. It's, sure. it's a movie. It's okay. Okay. We'll make it. Okay. We'll make it. I didn't. I. You know what? I missed that part. I it was like a quick spider. little yeah. flash of like a yeah. cobweb corridor, and mm. it brought me back to like Indiana Jones, and it's just kind of like ah. oh, oh, my God. <laughs> oh yeah. like Temple of Doom, like we're all course, like, like or in the Raiders yeah. when they're the on this spider yeah. Yeah. too. Right. Oh man. Uh, oh yeah the little yeah in uncharted 3 when he when that would be a great like if there's like a he's okay. got to use the torch to yeah. get the spiders away <laughs> yeah that'd be kind of cool uh, I think it looks cool though. Um, even like the little postcard that he gets from Sully, and there's like a secret little message. Oh, from like, Sam. He's holding up like the from or from Sam. Sorry. Yeah. That's okay. Um, well, like that... all those different things. Like it's, I don't know. It's it's cool. Like I love the attention to detail. Like they really put a lot of time and effort. The crystals or sand or salt, whatever it is that has like the map, like yeah. whatever it was in. Like just all of those little little things. The the keys. The I don't know what those are. Yeah. I've seen it really looked cool. great too. I thought the, yeah. the lighting and the different things. Mm-hmm. It just it was it, it was it, it was fun. It was colorful and lit well and and yeah. It, it screamed it it screamed pulp adventure, which is what you know that with the, the what coloring. Amy Hennig nailed in the first three. That that that's what she was really going for. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, and I think that was uh, and it and it, and it also had some of the you know some of the darkness and the danger that four uh, may have carried um, well. So. You know, it's one of those things where, um, and I like how they just made references, just enough references to the game to connect it and make people go, oh, look, Mm -hmm. oh, that. Mm -hmm. Um, But you know there's going to be so much more. Um, Yeah. It's just, it's just, it's exciting. Here's here's what I what I like because I I feel the I do I hear like I'm with I'm a big fan of the games like I I've platinumed all of them like all four games even Lost Legacy I'm I'm a big fan and I hear when fans are sort of like you're retconning like how Nate and Sully ma- met from the games or you're retconning uh, the the mm-hmm. uh, Sam how Sam enters into the mix you mm-hmm. know like he knows about Sam and you know Sam's you know b- like you know the the one of the big clues is like he's connected to this treasure somehow and that's not really how uncharted 4 but like what i like about the movie it's able to sort of fix the problems that i actually i thought the games had right like i thought it was weird to me how nate's brother sam was sort of introduced like randomly in the fourth in the mm-hmm. fourth game right where now it's sort of introduced as like a char- a big character point for mm-hmm. his motivation yeah. throughout why he does what he does, you know? And because I thought in the games, you know, obviously the games are very pulpy and very fun and they're meant to be that way. But like what, what drives Nathan Drake other than like, I'm hunting for treasure. I think the movie does a really good job of like giving him motivation, like a char- character motivation of like, this is connected to my brother. I, I have a reason to find this treasure. I have a reason to be connected to Sully. You know what I'm saying? I have a reason to be, to follow, you know, Chloe down these dark corridors and into, into these treasures. So, I think what the movie is going to be able to do is sort of be almost be a better story, like o- origin story, than what the games had to sort of uh, retroactively do as they move forward. And I think that it's it's really smart what they've done. Um, so I, I I'm excited about that. And all I can that's I'll, a good point. Po- yeah. And the other thing I want to say is like, holy shit, Chloe nails it in yeah. this trailer mm-hmm. yeah there's there's she's only in like four shots but it she does a really good job of like a being the like sassy as hell like you know fun we all love her because she's witty to there's a shot where she's holding a gun and she's like i forget what her line is but you're right away you're getting that like 
I'm double crossing you right now. Mm -hmm. the, the, the Chloe we, we love and know yeah. from, from that. She is a danger about her. Yeah, exactly. Yes. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And, yeah. and she's kind of a badass. We see her firing a couple shots on the, on the, on the, on the cargo plane too. So I'm really excited what they're doing with her character too, because I really liked the development she had in the games and especially throughout in lost legacy. So the fact that they're, they're really investing into her character, I think is really smart too, from mm -hmm. a, from a plot I think point. I think well, something that you touched on there that's interesting too is I the one thing that this trailer seems and what I know of the film I really think they're going to be able to I know people like things to be the perfect timeline and everything fits mm -hmm. in on a shelf in a, in a very yeah. OCD kind of way we just everything looks right but I think these two and hopefully this will become a franchise the film a film franchise hopefully mm -hmm. and the, the game franchise will be able to coexist and complement each other mm. uh, and not necessarily have to like has to fit this this yeah. this you know yeah. um you know it's and and maybe you know chloe was always a wild card and i thought um that I, it, you, that was set up in this you're like you have no idea what's going to happen mm -hmm. and i i just you know i i i sorry i just can't wait i was wish i wish it was a christmas <laughs> release I'm, I'm, i know you know What's yeah. our really Thanksgiving true? release? February but, uh, 18th. February? February 18th. What is it, the 18th? Yes, yeah. I think so, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah there's turning. Is that, was that Ireland or is that worldwide? Is that one um, day? How does a, that work? Excuse me, movie theater is February 18th, so I would imagine that's US release. Right. That's probably US yeah. release. Um, yeah, because it's a, the Sony platform. Um, yeah, this I mean, is good. I think there's some, some really great uh, points that I wanted to point out as well. Tati Gabriel, yeah. Gab Gabriel or Gabriel? Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Is she giving me Nadine vibes like totally. so hard? I'm loving mm -hmm. her character. I want to see more of her character. I want to see a spin-off mm -hmm. series. I want her character. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. She just took the trailer from me. Other than obviously your main character, like um, Tom and uh, Mark. Um, I think Sophia Ali is going to do a really good job as uh, Chloe. I would like to see more of that. I think like it's hinted at in the trailer, and I was like, no, I don't know if I'm like a hundred percent sold. But then I think it is that moment where she sort of has a gun. You're like, oh, 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 yeah. oh this could get mm -hmm. good. Mm -hmm. um, the spider thing. I also wanted to comment on um, Stephanie. So two parts in this. So this kind of looked like, hear me out, grave hunting. So when they went mm -hmm. in four, in Uncharted uh, four, when they went to Henry Avery's grave, they went underground and that kind of yeah. looked like that. Also, they were in Scotland, which could be why there was a Scottish lad at the end there. But can we talk about the glaringly obvious mishap of casting? Why is Graham McTavish not the Scottish guy? <laughs> I would have loved <laughs> to see him in the Scottish guy. Oh, that totally. would be so cool. Oh. But maybe he's got something that's else. Because, that's know. because Graham is on everything else. Right? That's yeah. true. Yeah, totally. They're like, can we put him he's in this? He's working yeah, he's all the time. They, they probably called um, him like, are you available? Not until yeah, 2028. 20, no. uh, right. Yeah. I, but you know what? Here's the other thing. I don't know if Graham, Graham is, I mean, gosh, that'd be great to have Graham is like. That would a, be so cool. Like if he could ever, if, you know, be like a, in, in something down the line. I think that, mm -hmm. that role, it looked, that role looked like a, like one of the, the henchman yeah it just looked know? like a henchman i thought it would be and cute camera, i think but... i think i think graham would uh require something much much bigger agree he'd, <laughs> yeah. he'd totally. like a meteor role yeah yes. well he looks yeah. like the yeah. like uh okay. like definitely one of the big bads like you're gonna have to, he's gonna have to take down you know yeah because like yeah. they show him there with okay. with uh <laughs> braddock who's played by tati and yeah i think antonio banderas like in the big uh, Scottish guy, mm -hmm. like out of coming out of the cargo plane or like entering the cargo yeah, plane. Yeah, but I got it. I was just, gonna go. No, this is not a here's not another spoiler. I like to put this out there. I have a hard time believing, just from my understanding of what Nathan Drake does, that he gets off that the Scottish lad, um, makes it off that plane alive. Yeah, no, <laughs> just, I would agree. I, I think that it's fight, a drawaway like, character. Mm, I'm not, not character, sure. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, I don't know. I just is like I don't know if he's gonna make it off that plane. He's like <laughs> that's like the big brute you fight at the end of that thing. Or, right. Yeah, it's a brute. Foot snaps him. Whoa, and out he goes. Um, <laughs> I think this. Um, I although think, I did not see a parachute anywhere, so I don't know how no. Drake lands. But I don't know how oh, Drake. He's a star, so I'm sure he no, made. No, if well, we played the third game, he looks game. like he fell out like a few times. Like that's he looks probably like he got how back it's... in the plane and then fell out again and right. like, had to get back yeah. up in again. Yeah. It's like, oh. <laughs> I feel like Nolan. They're going to do more of the Uncharted Three scene where he catches up to a cargo, uh, the right. lost car cargo, oh. and then pulls on the parachute and abseils down. 
pretzels yeah. down. You know, yeah. well, yeah, down. I mean, um, that's, that's how, I how did I'm it. thinking it. Yeah, but maybe yeah. not. And, and instead of landing in the desert, he lands uh, in probably ocean. on a beach with a with a boat in Scotland. Uh, no, in, yeah, in Scotland. Scotland. Yeah. yeah, by the way, well, yeah, because I mean, good. this looks like that it takes like, place. It was that was really pretty water that he was yeah. over. It was not the barren desert. Yeah, Lucky. In, the, in the behind the scenes PlayStation, you see the two of them sitting on the box floating in the ocean. Oh, no, ah, yeah, that's right. okay, okay. Yeah, good call. So they must have, yeah. Yeah, Who, who's the, the two of them? You can't Sully. tell. Sully? Uh, I mean, you assume it's, you assume it's uh, uh, Drake, but I don't know who the other one is. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Ooh, interesting. Yeah. Um, the other thing that I would say about this, like, look, I mean, I, I think I totally agree with you, Nolan. This is a completely standalone thing. I think they should mm -hmm. exist, like, coexist and complement each other. And that's probably why I'm a fan. Um, but I would like to know. Is there going to be a supernatural element to this? Because there is. Mm, Almost every game except four, there's Maybe. a supernatural element. And I would really, I'd be yeah. interested to see if that makes its way. I don't know if that would tank the movie. I don't know. But, yeah, um, but, but that's, okay, that's a good point. So think about that. Does that in in a movie mm -hmm. work? I tend to feel like that yeah, would true. make me go, That it, it would make me go crystal skull. Oh, yeah. fair. Okay, we yeah, got yeah, aliens. Yeah, we true. got super now. We got aliens now. Oh god. Yeah. I, I wonder yeah. if that would take away. Like, aliens the, uh, make any I think movie if you did better. like a... I'm sorry. Aliens make any movie better. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, did, it did not. They make, did not. For instance, it did not make Indiana Jones four better. Call, as soon as there's anything. aliens in the movie, I'll watch it. Like I don't care how bad it is. <laughs> yeah. I watched Millennium with Chris Christopherson and Cheryl Ladd. I mean, because there might That's... have been an alien in it. Yeah. Your phone was so bad it disappeared from the DVD case. It just vanished yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's probably it, it left on its own accord the aliens yeah. uh, i think i think out. you're right though nolan i don't know if that would work um i don't know we'll, we'll kind of see um even if they took like put a nod to it like stephanie said like with the spiders and the webs and something like that i like yeah. the nods that we're getting in this trailer as well we've gotten um you know the the auction scene where you know there's a casino royale nod and i love that um because it's very mm -hmm. bond and indiana jones and the mummy and you know it's very it, it, it's very spy uh and i'm i'm a big fan of that i also like um all of the stuff that's recognizable from four in this so like your beautiful crystal clear waters and being on the boat um the ship scene at the end is also very kind of reminiscent of um you know um uh libertalia and stuff like that in, in four mm -hmm. sam is obviously in this as well I think this is going to be really interesting. Is, do you think, now here's a question, Pagan, is Sam in it? Oh, that's a good question, I mean, actually. They, I think they, he's you, in it. They, they refer to, to him. <laughs> I, it, to I, I, I think it's a cut scene. Be like... I think it's an in, in scene, like an after credit scene. I think. Oh, a post credit scene, yeah. Yeah, I don't think he's in the film, but I think Could there's be. some. there'll be some reveal of maybe who yeah. Sam might be playing in the, in the sequel. Yeah. Uh, or who might be playing Sam? I think I'm I'm too old to play Sam, and if they've shot it already, I'm probably shit out of luck. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you don't know. Make some calls. I would imagine. Can, I could uh, be a, can... I'm just thinking like street vendor, and, and then maybe they'll do another yes. one. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. After this one, <laughs> then I'll look right down the barrel. Yeah, you know, you, you, you know. <laughs> That'd be great. Uh, I want to I want to take thing. some time. Uh, uh, to open it up if anybody has any questions they can uh ping us on riverside if you're a member you can join us uh and call in as they say or if there's any questions mm -hmm. in the uh, youtube live chat that you want to ask maybe we can dive into um and while we wait for that uh pj i mean do you have any other thoughts i think you, you, you kind of started maybe. out <clears throat> yeah, what started out as like? a little bit well, of... you guys are you guys are, remember i was looking at it for the element of was it a good trailer it doesn't mm -hmm. mean i'm shitting on her i'm gonna not watch her that and i loved all the elements you did one thing that no one talked about was the way it was colored. If you really did look at it, especially that shot where he came from behind him in the cave, the coloring was very reminiscent of some of the game style of coloring, in my opinion. They did a good job on adding a lot of black point to it in certain parts, and it, it kind of had a game feel. At one point, I was mm -hmm. even like, holy shit, that looks just like a game. Yeah. So I, I wonder, and I'd like to talk to colorists, if they did that on purpose to, to kind of match mm. that, Probably. to match that vibe. Because it didn't have that that dark cinematic look like you remember the Batman mm -hmm. did the other day. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. it, it had a little more snap to it. Uh, so I'm wondering if that was intentional. But uh, I, I, I'm torn. You know damn well I'm going to watch it. You know damn well I'm going to go see it because mm -hmm. of Nolan. Uh, I just wonder as a trailer, did it do its job? And I, I don't give it an A for that. Really? But okay. I will still go see it. I thought the, the PlayStation one 
made me want to see it more than that because it goes back to that thing. And although I'm not a big Wahlberg fan, I do see the chemistry between the two of them in this, and it really shows in that PlayStation thing. Mm -hmm. So uh, mm -hmm. behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That 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 gave me a little more nod to <clears throat> to watch that. So yeah, I'm uh, I'm uh, a thumbs up. I want to watch it. I just want to know. You know, I hope it's. Well, I hope it does. The other thing, the other thing with the other thing with Wahlberg that I kind of like is that he's been attached to this thing for a while. At one point, he was going to play Drake, and, and they they're lining something up like with him to do it. So he That's must. Right. I I don't know if he even plays video games. I don't know if he has time. The guy never stops working, <laughs> but he must be a fan of this, or maybe his kids are. He's like, yeah, I'll do that, and, but. I go back. It goes back to the word enthusiasm. You know, I mean, these are people, guys who, they don't need more money. They're doing things that they would be fun or that they're excited about, and I think that's a great recipe for success when you put talented people together, who are there with a, 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 some some passion, some some excitement, enthusiasm to, to play those roles, to be part of this adventure, and. Mm -hmm. um, and that you know, passion I, usually I, translates I, into a good movie. And if it's a good movie, yeah. Yeah. it doesn't matter mm -hmm. what the fans say. A good movie is a good movie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's nice that, yeah. like you said, Nolan, um, Tom is a massive fan of the games and he wanted to talk to you about the character. And, like, he yeah. really does know about the weight that he carries. And I do think it's kind of unfair. A lot of people are like, no, he's, like, not the perfect casting. I think you're wrong. I think he is perfect casting. He's got, like, the sarcasm, mm -hmm. the wit, the humor. He's a, yeah. he's a stuntman in the fact that he's an actor mm -hmm. as well. Like, I, I think he's a great casting. And I think when he said those things like, oh, crap, and when, when he's surprised by the Scottish guy to the what, mm -hmm. love that. I think that's so Nathan Drake. That's just yeah. so Nathan Drake that it's not Tom Holland, it's not Peter Parker, gonna, and I think people should learn forever. to differentiate between... The fact that Tom Holland yeah. is well, just a working actor and he's great for this. I think he's great. I think Sorry. it's oh, we have a hard out, Drew. You know that. Eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll wrap up oh, here. Right. Um, I, 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 missed... just, I do. I do... Oh, sorry. Oh, go I was going to say sorry. I missed uh, super chat. I don't see it anymore, so I do apologize. Oh. But thank you guys so much for the soup. Yeah, totally. And uh, yeah, any fun question? There was one question I saw. Is there going to be a Marco Polo joke? Uh, I would imagine oh, that would be that would be pretty. Hagen and I were talking about. We were talking about uh, that pre-recording. We were like, "Can there be a Marco wonder, Polo joke?" Yeah. You know what the thing? The, you know, that's the funny balance. That yeah, that'd be a great idea. I, I think it, there's got to be a point where this is the kind of movie that's ripe for multiple sequels. You know, this is yeah. mm -hmm, the yeah. perfect kind of trilogy kind of movie or more. I don't know. I mean, just the way. And again, this isn't a spoiler. I have no idea. <laughs> I, it just, but it seems like the kind of movie. If it does well, they're like, we're going to do another one. Yeah. Um, and you, you can't put every joke and every little thing into one movie. But you can see, like, oh, you know, if we do do it too, uh, we didn't get to the Marco Polo thing. Let's do that too. Let, you know, let's let's do a nod to their. I, I'd like to see if there's a nod to the Jeep. Oh, yeah. You know, uh, oh, that, that okay. Jeep was iconic through the games. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, that yeah. thing, you know. I was thinking uh, the same and I, it'd be, scene. By the way, wouldn't it be perfect for like Toyota to jump on as a sponsor and go, we want it to be a Toyota because it lasts all the time, takes these bullets. And, you know, because, you know, that's what all these movies are doing. Mm -hmm. You know, Jason Statham's driving an Audi. In fact, everybody in the movie's driving an Audi. Mm -hmm. You know, oh, yeah. it's, you know, you know how it is. It, Bond does that. I mean, yes, he does. Aside yeah. from the Aston, I mean, there's always like. So, again, not a spoiler, but. Just a hell of an idea. And Toyota, you can reach directly out to me and I can uh, get you in touch I would with like people. to broker that deal. Yeah. Yeah, nice. I will take care of that. Actually, uh, actually, reach out to PJ because mm -hmm. we and Drew, we work together and they handle that kind of stuff. So you reach out directly out to Red Bear. Uh, it's Red Bear. Uh, TV. R E D B E A R. <laughs> Just uh, CEO is Grouchy Pants, apparently. Yeah. Grouchy Pants, and CEO. Yeah. Huh? And wow. Yukon Cornelius. <laughs> Cornelius. <laughs> oh, sure, that's man. it. You look like when you wear your little toque, you definitely look like Yukon Cornelius. <laughs> Bubbles <laughs> bounce. You should totally do that for Halloween. <laughs> Uh, no. Oh god. No, that's a hard no. Um, <laughs> man, I, I, I'm excited. I, it's, I, I'm like everyone. I, I, I'm, a, I'm always cautiously optimistic. This trailer, I think, did a good job. It, I. Again, the energy, man. Um, I haven't seen mm -hmm. a trailer that felt this fun in a long time. 
you know, and and I think it's been a long time since everything now seems like overly serious. Either it's like we're going to be super dark and be in Batman or uh, it's like super Artur and it's Dune um, or it's like just plain ridiculous and it's Fast and the Furious. But this feels grounded and polished and just plain like a good action film. Like it's mm-hmm. it's I, and I don't know. I, it's like I've been missing this for a long time, like this kind of movie. Mm. I've been I've been yeah. waiting for this kind of fun, pulpy uh, kind of uh, film. And I'm glad they're kind of delivering it on that. Um, so I guess that, that's kind of my final wrap on that. I, mm. I, I, this, and I'm, I'm excited to mm. see more, but I'm always cautiously optimistic when a video, when they're trying to make something so beloved as, as Uncharted into a, into a new medium. I'm, I'm, I, I want it to be so good, but I, I, I'm gonna walk that line a little bit too. Uh, so. Nice. Yeah, Fantastic. I, I, if I, oh, go see I will it. say that I will tell you, yes, go see it. I will tell you there's one thing I'm disappointed in so far. Like I saw multiple opportunities for cameos. Um, I mean, why not? I'm the guy at the bar who turns to Wahlberg. Friend shouldn't do that. He goes, excuse me? And he looked kind of nice and shouldn't hold his ear when he's talking to you. Looks like an idiot. Aww. You know, that could have been fun. <laughs> you know, that, that could have been, been I was more picturing thing. something like or, someone Or I could have played Chloe. Oh. Yeah, you could, like you could be like yeah. a great little yes. <laughs> yeah, I've been working out. I've yeah. leaned down. You, sh- you straddle Tom Holland. <laughs> Turn your hair. To do like Nice. Flies. You, you know, they said I, was, I just was. They said I was too hulking. <laughs> yeah, and it would look like I was. It would look like I was. I was. It was right, hurting the him. The, uh, the makeout <laughs> scene with you and Tom Holland just wasn't. The chemistry wasn't there, no. so they recast. That. No, it wasn't. No. We did a screen no. test like eight, nine, fifteen mm-hmm. times. Yeah. I was like, "Can we do another? I think we'd do another." I just I'm almost <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, "No, please stop." Tom is oh, crying oh. at this point. I thought that was tears of joy. Is he yeah. upset over yeah, something? Yeah, that's upsetting. <laughs> Sorry, uh, and by the way, can I get a can I get a, can I get a wipe? For this, can I get a wipe from my hand? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Just clean up, clean up time. Clean up no, I am grateful for them to. We did. I I don't know when they'll be doing that. We did do some like cool. Uh, you know, I got the uh, talk. You know, and they asked there was some. I don't even know who it was. I'm embarrassing myself in case they're watching, but I think it was Sony or the studio basically said it's nice to have you here. I'm just talking about like the franchise, so. I, I think I was brought there for like this BTS stuff. I don't know where that'll be, but um, Aww, it's, it's just kind of like so cool, cool stuff to be able to talk with him. And and um, I, I want to thank them again for for having me out there just to just to see how it how the it was pretty cool. And I did see some things that aren't in the trailer that everybody's gonna like, but I didn't see Ooh. enough to ruin the movie for me. So oh, okay. um, let's well, go. So go see the Uncharted trailer. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, well, yeah. Go see the trailer. Go see the movie exclusively yes. in theaters. Is which is my favorite thing. Mm-hmm. And uh, it, it, hopefully we'll be uh, maybe we'll get some exclusive stuff coming down the line closer to the movie. Mm-hmm. So check in with Couch Soup. Check Nolan North. Uh, follow us all on socials. And uh, as stuff comes down the line, maybe Sony will want to share with us some some fun stuff. So we'll we'll keep you guys in the loop on all things Uncharted. Uh, on the website and on mm-hmm. here on, on Trailer Talk and more. So um, thank you all for Thanks. joining us. Thanks, Nolan, for for giving us the scoop, man. That was that was good. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, Nolan. That, that, that's Thanks, all. That's everyone. it's a little scoop because I don't have a big scoop, but um, I, I, like I'm very scoop. excited and I think everybody should be. Yeah, you have I mean, a big scoop. Agreed. Don't worry. It, no, listen, if Nathan scoop. Drake says go watch this movie, I think you should mm-hmm. you should yes. probably go watch it. Go, go watch the movie. Buy your tickets. Doesn't get any better than that. Yeah. All right, really. Thank you. Bye, right, guys. Bye, Thanks, everybody. everybody. Bye, guys.